We're one of the best facilities in the world. And so it's really hard for us to just grab any old graduate. We need someone who's really quite specifically trained and we know that they're going to be able to come on board and hit the ground running with very little mentorship and TAFE can do that. I always loved movies and I was always a bit of a computer nerd, so visual effects was a nice marriage of those two, I suppose. The best things about the course was that from day one, we were just sort of sat down using the programs that I use now in the job and just started using it and learning it from scratch. Um, yeah, just straight away. And I think that sort of hands-on approach, there's no quicker way to learn than to just jump in there and go for it. I would like to be a visual effects supervisor. So working here with the supervisors that talk to the Hollywood supervisors, yeah, I see myself doing something like that. That's what I want. Yeah, there's always a way up. One day I sat down and saw a visual effects compositing breakdown and I was so inspired and I started Googling and then found out about the course and just applied and got in. Uh, you know, you have some actors, like some blue screen or green screen doing whatever they're doing and then, you know, you add all these bits of pieces that, you know, all these artists collaborate just to create this cool looking shot, you know. I came across the TAFE course and yeah, just uh, enrolled and um, got into it and just started loving it from day one. Straight away I just knew it was like a hands-on kind of technical side of it as well. I love the lecturers, they were great. Um, they really encouraged us to push ourselves. They were really mentoring us to just, you know, aim for the highest quality. I loved it, yeah. It's a really good feeling once you, you put in eight hours into say two seconds of footage and then you see the whole movie up on the screen, it's really good. And you see your name on the credits, it's amazing, yeah. I really want to push into modelling and sculpting and creating 3D sculptures. That's hard to get into, so I might need to maybe study again for it. See, the, uh, the TAFE course could be a, a good stepping stone into the university. TAFE has always been very much about listening to what we need. We want to hire local people and we want to hire South Australians. Recently, we almost tripled in size because we had a lot of work and to do that, we've got to fly people in from all over the world because there aren't enough people trained in South Australia at the level we need. And working with TAFE is part of us helping to build a pool of people that we can hire locally. So once the TAFE graduates have finished working with us, they might do like Dylan did, they might fly off to Canada for a year, or they might go to London, or they might go to Germany or Montreal. It's a really international industry and we recognise that we're training not just for us but, but globally for the world. And I guess it's our hope that, you know, when they get sick of flying around the world, they'll come back here and, and work for us again. We've got a lot of TAFE graduates. I would say of all of the educational institutions in South Australia, they are the highest represented amongst our employee base. I see it going from strength to strength. Um, they're really open to listening to us and what we need. You want education to listen to you and to produce the kind of graduates that you need and um, TAFE have certainly shown that they've done that. Most people on Monday mornings wake up and go, oh, work again. You know, I go, oh, work, awesome. I can't wait. So, no, it's great. It's good to be doing what I love.